This is home. And our roots run as deep as the love we have for this place. Owned by the same Cincinnati company for more than 70 years. And what matters to you matters to us. This is WCPO 9 News. Thanks for joining us for WCPO 9 News. I'm Tanya O'Rourke. Here's a look at some of today's top stories. Police identify the man shot by a Fairfield officer. They responded to Port Union Road after a person who called 911 hung up. When they got there, police say they found Rodolfo Molina Hernandez in a driveway with a gun they believe to be real. Now, according to an incident report, he refused several orders to drop the gun and then pointed it at the gun, at the at officer Robert Davis. Davis then opened fire. Now, police released this picture of the gun after the shooting on radio traffic. You hear Officer Davis say once he saw that firearm that it looked like a toy. State investigators, though, confirm it is in fact a real gun. Molinas Hernandez is in the hospital and he will face charges. We have an update tonight on the person hit by a car while on an e-scooter and over the Rhine. The person's mother says doctors had to remove part of her, their skull, but they were able to open their eyes and give a, give a thumbs up. The person was hit while traveling through the intersection of Finley and Elm Streets and over the Rhine. Witnesses say it appeared the car ran the red light, but police have not said who's at fault. Let's get a check of your forecast. Here's Chief Meteorologist Steve Raleigh. Tanya, as we look at things, generally some clouds around here for tonight. Uh, we are going to see a small chance for rain. Uh, most folks will stay dry right through the morning, 61 overnight. Then for tomorrow, we're going to see the clouds thickening up, especially in the afternoon. Storms will develop by 3, 4 o'clock, and we are calling for a 9 first warning weather alert day tomorrow. A high temperature, 80 degrees, but after the front rolls through, temperatures cool. Another chance for storms Friday evening, but a nice weekend ahead.